I am Dr. Basma Gamal Awad. I'm a lecturer in the Faculty of Dentistry, Ain Shams University, in the Department of Pediatric Dentistry and Dental Public Health. Uh, I am presenting for you uh, today my project for I am a famous uh, batch of 2022. Uh, my project is entitled Linking the Dental Industry to the Dental Curricula. It's a designing a program uh, course. It's a three-step project. Uh, it's under the supervision of uh, Professor Nagua National. This is my timeline for the GAM chart. Uh, I was supposed to uh, start reviewing the literature by JAM and to get the, uh, uh, both the ethical uh, approval as well as uh, formation of my team by February and then to present uh, this proposal to the departments uh, in my faculty. The whole idea behind my project was that we graduate some uh, uh, the, the general practitioner dentists. Uh, dentist. They are not very well aware of the products in the market, and uh, we are then exposed to different uh, marketing uh, companies that are having their uh, products all over, and uh, we found that the dentists have uh, a lack in their experience in how to select the proper product uh, for the cases that they need. So we decided to create a pilot uh, program that was supposed to be uh, taken during the internship year for every student in his uh, round. In the internship year, we have like 12 months. Every month, the student passed by a certain department. So we decided to create this course related to every specialty in each month. So it orients more the general practitioners that are about to graduate after their internship years by the different products that are available in the market to help in their proper selection of their materials and their instruments as well. Accordingly, we first decided to develop a questionnaire to the perception of the faculty members respect the importance of this uh, topic at the beginning. And uh, we started uh, to uh, design this questionnaire after formulating the team and distributed among different uh, faculty members to know if this is topic was important for them or not. Uh, after uh, dissemination of the questionnaire, we analyzed the results and after reaching uh, the, uh, the, the results that this uh, topic is quite important, we started to sit again together and start to design a pilot course in a certain specialty to be taught later on by end of this uh, year or the beginning of the new internship year. And accordingly, we started to collect and prepare the material required for this course, as well as we will start to conduct the course by the beginning of the, the coming internship year. Then we will validate the scores and then analyze the results. Uh, after that, we are supposed to um, conduct the uh, analysis of the results by the end of this year. And then the poster presentation was supposed to be by the coming gen. There was a, a bit of a changes in the timeline uh, due to several uh, issues. Primarily, I'm not, uh, I don't have lots of free time to conduct uh, the timeline as expected. So a certain stuff was uh, a little bit uh, delayed, like the formation of the team. Instead of being in Feb, it was moved to uh, March. Uh, the presentation of the protocol or the, uh, the, uh, the, uh, the plan to the school itself was delayed till April. The designing of the questionnaire itself and its development was also postponed to May and, uh, uh, and June instead of April, as well as the analysis of the results. So currently, we're on the step of analyzing the questionnaire results. And later on, we're supposed to uh, start designing the pilot course and implementing it by the beginning of the next internship. The lessons that we learned is the time management is very important to stick the time plan that has been set primarily. Uh, teamwork was very important, uh, getting to uh, the ideas and sitting to brainstorm uh, the questions itself involved in the questionnaire that we did for the staff members. Uh, reviewing similar projects that has been done in other countries was very important. So the review of literature, we have found several countries that have done similar uh, courses. So reading their experiences was helpful, as well as the continuous revision of the steps that we have done and conducting any necessary adjustments uh, helped a lot to reach our uh, goal. Uh, by this, I've reached the uh, end of my uh, uh, presentation. I hope it was fruitful and thank you for e everyone for your